This is going to be from a, a leg press position. You can't get the arm free. And we're going to go immediately into kind of a, uh, a straddle pin, uki gatami, into a mount situation, a you know, ver vertical hold, and going into a nice bent arm lock on the near side. But we're never going to let go of the near arm. Okay, so want to want to show that, Derek? And here we go. Okay. So I, I like this position a lot. Uh, Steve showed it to me um, pretty early. I think I was like a yellow belt when he showed this to me the first time. I love going from straight arm locks to bent arm locks because you can waffle back and forth and it, it usually confuses guys pretty well. Uh, the other thing I like about it is we're never giving up control. Okay, we're just switching our position a little bit and actually gaining a little bit more control. So we're just gonna kind of flow through it here. We've started in the leg press. I've got control of his arms, trying to get him free. None of my levers are working. Maybe I'm tired. Maybe he's just a step, okay? So what I'm gonna do instead is I'm gonna go back into uki gatami, which is a straddle pin, okay? Not a very, I mean, you could hold a guy in it, but it's more of a transitional pin, okay? So the key here is I'm gonna keep this nice and tight, and if I need to, I'm gonna anchor the hand closest to his head on my hip, because that'll allow me to lean a little bit on it and I won't have to post my hand, okay? So as soon as I get this, I lean forward, kick back, and push up, okay? Notice I still got the arm, right? And I didn't have to post my hand to get up, and it puts a lot of pressure on poor Eric's ribs, okay? So it's hard for him to, to breathe right now. I'm not gonna hold this very long because I wanna eventually get mount and move to something else. So again, I keep my hands on his arm still, and I just switch my legs, all right? His elbow's still firmly in my chest where it started. From there, I uppercut my hand and I pull towards the outside. As soon as I get that, I just roll that hand over, get his wrist, get my other wrist, put my elbow on the ground, and then paint his arm on the mat, okay? Guys, real point, did you see how he put his elbow right in the kind of the crook of Eric's neck, his left elbow? And that, that's, that's a good fulcrum right there. So if we were doing it from this side, I'm right here, okay? I pull the arm out towards the outside, okay? That gets my hand in the perfect position for when I grab that to grab my other wrist, okay? It's the least amount of effort to get that figure four grip. Put your elbow down right next to his ear. Don't be out here because he'll just straighten his arm and get out of the move, okay? So if I've already got control of his shoulders with my knees, I just wanna put this down here and make sure that I stay in this chicken wing, okay? And then from there, it's just paint his knuckles on the on the floor, and that's it. Keep his elbow up, guys. Yeah. <clears throat> also, watch what he does with his legs as he's starting to come around. He doesn't let that leg stick out mm -hmm. straight here. He wraps it right. around. Otherwise, you're going to be in an awkward position. You're not going to be able to transit mm -hmm. to the next part. So you keep your, your feet in, just like Sandy was saying, okay? Grab the anchor hip if I need it. Lean forward, kick back, and push, okay? As soon as I get that, I roll my knee back and tuck it in, okay? See, he's also trapping his head with his right knee. It's, he's trapping the guy. His whole body is really now secure and controlled. Yeah. His feet are in, knees are in, he's stuck, okay? Still have the, the, the elbow real nice and tight. Pull out, wrist, wrist, elbow on the ear, and pain on the mat. Okay, nice and tight, go slowly. It might take a little getting used to, to lean forward and kick back, okay? The more difficult it is to kick, full, to kick back, just lean forward more, okay? It'll work. Don't put your leg on here, let that leg wrap. Okay. Can you do it one more time just, to, more just to run it? So guys, watch this, how, and, and again, he said, slowly, but be efficient, you know? You don't have to do this real fast. He's stuck on his back, you're winning, okay? Mm -hmm. so, so you know you're in a good position and use that position. Keep working to a better position. That's mm -hmm. what he's doing here. Right, and if, worst case scenario, just grab his belt or his leg, okay? Kick so back. That gives you a little pull up there and it's right. a good idea. And I'm still not posting my hand anywhere, okay? But I, I still have to come back here and scoop, okay? Pull him over this way, wrist, wrist. Elbow down on the ear, paint. Okay. So leg press. Leg press. Okay. To straddle hold. To mount. To bent arm lock. Okay. Good. Again, be efficient. You've got it. Okay, let's give that a try. Okay, there we go.